The wait goes on in the U.S. state of Missouri. A citizens panel considering evidence in the city of Ferguson will not meet until Monday. The panel is trying to decide whether to indict the police officer, Darren Wilson, who is white, for killing an unarmed teenager, Michael Brown, who is black, back in August. Ferguson saw days of rioting following Brown's death. For more now, we're going to go live to Ferguson and CCTV's Hendrick Sabrandi. Hendrick, what is the latest there? Well, Susan, the rain continues here in Ferguson, and so does the wait. Two and a half months after Michael Brown's death, a, a grand jury will reconvene on Monday to consider evidence in the case. And people on all sides of this issue, police, protesters, and others, will be watching. The barricades are in place, police officers are standing watch, and the media is setting up in the parking lot outside the Justice Center in Clayton, Missouri. An announcement of a grand jury decision could be made right here once jurors finally complete their work. The uncertainty of a possible indictment of Officer Darren Wilson is weighing heavily on many residents of Ferguson some 10 miles away. Sometimes I can't sleep because I don't know what's going on outside. I don't know what's going on on this floor. See, it's really hard, and it's, the stress level is beyond the scale. Meantime, protesters have taken to the streets of Ferguson over the past several nights. A possible dress rehearsal for the moment, a decision is made. On Saturday evening, a group marched from the exact spot that Michael Brown was shot and killed to the street where much of the looting took place in August. Others gathered at the Ferguson Police Department, where there were several arrests. One group, the Disciples of Justice, says it's closely watching how police and protesters interact, and members will be on the scene if large demonstrations occur. We want the police to know that uh, Disciples of Justice will be out each and every night. It's not, I'm not saying it in a threatening manner at all. I'm just saying that we are out and we are watching everything that is going on uh, from both sides of the fence. My message is community stay peaceful. The message also that don't give up because things are changing. The, the world is, is watching. The whole world is focusing on Ferguson. Now all sorts of plans are in place for when a decision is reached by the grand jury. The police have their plans. Protesters have their plans. But it's not clear at all whether they'll be put into effect even as soon as Monday or whether a decision will be reached even this week. Reporting live, Hendrick Sabrandi, CCTV, Ferguson, Missouri.